Hey everybody, Mike and Money here helping you make money on YouTube. I am part of a large group of people who help each other make money on YouTube and I will tell you how you can join us at the end of the video. If you are looking for how to make YouTube videos without showing your face, then you are in the right place. I understand that making faceless YouTube videos can be very overwhelming at first, but don't worry because Today, I'm going to share with you the fastest and easiest way that you can get started making money on YouTube without showing your face. Now let's get straight into this video. So here are the things that you are going to need to make a great faceless YouTube video. You're going to need a good idea and a good title. You're going to need a script, a voiceover, video footage, then you need to edit it all together, then you're going to need a thumbnail, and finally you need to upload and optimize it. Now that might sound like a lot of stuff, but I am telling you that isn't that hard once you get the hang of it and I'm going to show you the fastest and easiest way to do all of this in this video, starting right now with step one, a good idea and a good title. Here's two fast and easy ways to come up with good faceless video ideas and good titles that people will want to click on and watch. Okay, so the first one is to use good keywords. You can use free tools like vidIQ and TubeBuddy to find low competition keywords that lots of people are searching for on YouTube. For example, here's how you do it if you're using vidIQ. You just type in a topic that you're thinking about making a video on, sort it by overall, and look for keywords with the lowest competition and the highest search volume. Then build a video title using one or two of these keywords. Check the description below to get links so you can start using vidIQ and TubeBuddy totally for free. Okay, now the second way to quickly come up with good video ideas and titles is to just look at other popular videos on YouTube. So go to YouTube and search for a topic that you're thinking about making a video on. Then sort the results to show videos uploaded in the last 30 days. And then sort it again by the view count. Now this is going to show you what videos are popular right now instead of videos that were most popular two or three years ago. So look for videos that are getting at least 50,000 to 100,000 views in the last 30 days. These are good video topics and titles that you could use to model your own videos after. So go find a video title that you like that has at least 50,000 to 100,000 views or more and rewrite the title slightly so that your video stands out. You don't want to completely copy it, but make it similar. Now that you have your video title, it's time for step two of how to make faceless YouTube videos. Step two is writing the script. Now you want to write about 1200 to 1500 words in your faceless video script if you're making an eight to 10 minute video. So if you're doing a top 10 video, that's gonna break down to 120 to 150 words for each item in the top 10 video list. So the first step is to find three or four good sources that you trust. You can get these from trusted articles online and even other videos on YouTube. Just make sure it's from somewhere that you actually trust because you definitely want to make sure that you're giving out good information on your faceless YouTube channel. Then go to each article and each video and grab three or four bullet points from each one and rewrite them in your own words. This is very important because you cannot just straight up copy other articles and videos. You have to rewrite them so it's in your own words. After you have written a script for your faceless video, it's time for step three, recording the voiceover. Now this one is easy. Just record yourself speaking the script. You can plug a mic into your computer like I'm doing right now and record with a free program like Audacity, or you can just use your phone to record your voiceover. And make sure to cut out any long silences or any parts that you mess up. After you have recorded your voiceover for your faceless video, it's time for step four. But before I can go any further, it is time for the random subscriber shout out. Today's shout out goes to M, I survived, so can you. Congratulations, M. Thank you very much for subscribing. I hope these videos are helping you make money on YouTube. Want me to shout out your channel? Well, all you have to do is subscribe and leave a comment on this video, and maybe I will shout out your channel in the next video. Now, the next step after you record your voiceover is step four, getting the video footage. Okay, we're gonna use free stock footage from Pexels and Pixabay for the video footage in our new faceless YouTube video. 
Now to keep people watching your video, you want to cut to a different video clip every three to seven seconds. So you're gonna need about nine to 20 video clips for each one minute of your faceless YouTube video. So go through your script and get nine to 20 video clips for each 150 words in your script or each paragraph. To do this, just go to Pexels or Pixabay and search for whatever your script is talking about. Then find some videos that generally go along with what you're talking about in the script and download them. Now these are all totally royalty free, so you are free to use them on YouTube in your videos. You can also use photos in your faceless YouTube video if you find some great photos that you want to use too. Just make sure you're getting them from somewhere like Pexels or Pixabay because these are totally royalty free. Now, after you've downloaded all your video clips and photos, it's time for step five, edit it all together. If you have never edited a video before, this might sound kind of overwhelming, but I promise you, it's not that hard and you can definitely do this. Now, I recommend that you use a program called OpenShot because it's 100% free and open source. It's very simple and fast and you can learn it very quickly and it's available for everything. You can get it for Windows, Mac, Linux. You can even get it for Chrome OS. So all you need to do is download OpenShot, start a new project, and choose the profile of HD 1080p 30fps. Then drag your video clips, photos, and your voiceover audio into the project files. Then drag your voiceover to the timeline below on track one, and then start dragging your video clips down and put them on track two. You can press the space bar to play back your video and see what you got. Use the trim tool to make cuts where you need to. And you will also want to select all the video clips on track two, right click and go to volume, entire clip and set it to zero. So the only thing you hear is your audio. You can also get free music from the YouTube audio library if you want to add music to the background of your faceless videos. Just make sure that you check the license type and give credit to the artist if it is required. You can put titles and text on screen if you want, and you can even add other effects and transitions if you want to. Then export the video with the profile HD 1080p 30fps and make sure the quality is set on high. Make sure the target format is MP4 H.264 and then click export video. Now you can find more in-depth tutorials for free on YouTube that will show you how to use all of the features in OpenShot. I just wanted to give you a brief overview in this video to get you started. So now that you have your new faceless YouTube video edited and exported, it's time for the second to last step, step six, making the thumbnail. Now you can use a free tool like Canva to do this. Just go to Canva and select create a design and then choose YouTube thumbnail. You can browse through their templates or you can create something totally from scratch. It's up to you. They even give you free stock photos that you can use on your thumbnail. So here's a tip for making great faceless YouTube video thumbnails that will get you lots of clicks. Open a brand new incognito browser window and go to YouTube and then search for the title of your new faceless video. Okay, now look at what the top few thumbnails are doing here and model your thumbnail after one of these, or find some elements that you like that catch your eye and use them in your thumbnail. Now you do not want to just straight up copy their thumbnail 100%, but make your thumbnail look very similar. The reason you're doing this is because these top results here are the most popular videos on YouTube for your video title, and that means they're getting lots of clicks and they're getting lots of watch time. So if you model your thumbnail after one of these successful thumbnails, you're probably going to get lots of clicks too. After you've made your thumbnail, it's time for the final step. Step seven, upload and optimize. So upload your video and make sure that you use the good title that you came up with in step one. Then use a tool like vidIQ or TubeBuddy to optimize your video using the best description, tags, and keywords so you get the most views possible. This will result in you making more money once your channel gets monetized. Now there's a lot of little details that I didn't have time to put into this video. So if you are serious about making money on YouTube with faceless videos, you definitely should join our group of creators. 
We help each other make money on YouTube and you also get a full course that will hold your hand and show you step by step exactly what to do and all the secrets to doing this the right way. If you're interested in that, click the first link in the description below to check it out. Thank you very much for watching. Please share this video with your friends and on social media if you have found it helpful. Then click here to watch this video where I show you some of the best faceless channel ideas that you can use to get started.